What's going on, David Dreamers? Mathers here with another episode of Shadowdown Live. Today I'm using this Vigoroth bulky offense team by two times the tap. Uh, it's a pretty cool team. I haven't tried it out yet, but it looks really cool. And it seems really thought, really well thought out because he didn't write a lot of stuff about it. And uh, yeah, it seems like it's going to be fun. So here we go with the team it is a jump left with no item acrobatics, which is really cool. Also a sleep powder, so pretty cool stuff. Also infiltrator to get through those subs, which is nice. Uh, Evie Light, Vigoroth with bulk up taunt, body slam, stack out, so just kind of like a stall breaker and also set up sweeper as well. Really cool, really powerful. Vigoroth is something I've never really thought of because I haven't played PU that much, but pretty cool. Uh, also, another Evie Light user here, Roselia. Uh, one of the top threats, I believe, in PU right now. Uh, the Evie Light, Natural Cure, Leaf Storm uh, with a modest max special attack does KO Piloswine which is something I said in the description, which is really cool. Also, Synthesis Recovery, Spikes, and Sludge Bomb with Dual Stab, which is nice. Um, Sorak is also here with Rocky Helmet and Max Defense. Stealth Rock, Will-O-Wisp, Morning Sun, and Zen Headbutt, really cool set. Uh, we also have Choice Scarf, Float Soul, which is interesting. Uh, has Baton Pass, which is cool, kind of gets that uh, every once in a while, you can get that initiative. Also, Hydro Pump, Ice Beam, nice powerful special attacking moves, and Hidden Power Electric to hit other water types. Uh, and we also have Raichu, Life Orb, super fast with uh, Nasty Plot, Thunderbolt, Focus Blast, Hidden Power Ice. So we have kind of a bulky offense paired up with two really fast guys. Lots of hazards as well. We got Spikes and Stealth Rocks, so cool team. I'm going to try it out right now. Let's see how it... Oh, fuck. <laughs> Almost found a RU match with that team, which would have not been fun. But I would have tried it. I would have tried it. Uh, so we got we got a PU battle here. This guy's got cool teams. You got a Politoed. You got a Licky Licky, Resilia, Armaldo, Mistrevis, and Rapidash. So... Huh. I don't believe... It. Oh, wait. Armaldo does get Rapid Spin. I am going to lead with Resilia. This that's lead with Licky Licky. I'm just going to go for a spike, see what he does. I, like, my one problem with this tier is that I don't know what things do, so I have no idea that Licky Licky was about to go for a knockoff and get rid of my... Evie Light. <laughs> oh well. I'm gonna go for a sludge bomb, see if we can get a nice poison right here. Nope, I don't. He goes for a wish. I knew it wished. I knew it wished. Um, I'm gonna go into. Wait, no, why, why? Okay, he switched out. I was like, wait a minute, he has knockoff. So he does decide to go into Satan, his Armaldo. As. Uh, I can't really stand on this thing. But I can go into Professor Pluff, my jump Pluff. Oh my god. <laughs> this guy needs to calm down. As long as I can land the sleep powder, which I do, this thing will go to sleep. And I can go for a U-turn. Alright, he does that switch there into the Roselia. Oh man, if only I had stayed in, I could go for an acrobatics. Going to he left. Okay, that wasn't my opponent. Never mind. I am Ian Rooney is not my opponent. Salamence Topius. Maybe he misspelled Tropius. Uh, I guess I could taunt this thing, right? Well, taunt the Miss Magus as well. Um, I can't hit it though, so. What am I going to on this? Roselia, I guess. As it does go back to Armaldo. I could probably KO this thing with a Leaf Storm, right? Maybe. I'm gonna go for it. Wakes up. Gets the spin off. Leaf Storm almost picks up the KO, but not quite. Not. Quite. I can probably go Soul Rock here, as he does pull a switch into his Licky Licky. And unfortunately this thing has knockoff, I did, I did just learn that. <laughs> uh, 
but if I get stealth rocks, that means the Armaldo will die to stealth rocks, and my hazards will be there to stay, which is nice. So I can just go for Will O Wisp here, burn this thing, which is nice. So the knockoff will not be doing a lot, as it does knock off the rocky helmet, so he also takes a little damage there as well. But fortunately for him, the wish does heal him, so. I do also have Morning Sun to heal, so I'm not too worried about that. I'm just going to go for a Zen Headbutt as I completely miss. So he just goes for Heal Bell. Nice. Okay, so Licky Licky is just like a standard Cleric for PU, basically. Um, I'm going to go into Roselia here, as he, because if he does want to go for a knockoff, my item's already gone. Uh, I'm just going to get some spikes up, because his hazard removal is gone. As he does for protect, so I'm able to just get up some spikes. I'm just gonna get up another spike, why not, you know? As Armaldo is gonna Oh Thankfully he does he does live the rocks, but he does the spikes, so he's not gonna be able to get rid of these. Which is beautiful for me as the rapid ash is gonna come in and take a hell of a lot of damage. And I'm pretty sure Soul Rock is a pretty safe counter to this thing, because the only move it could get is like drill run. It actually has Morning Sun, nice. And I have Levitate, so I think Megahorn would be his best move to hit me with. As uh, I'm just going to go for Zen Headbutt, as he does bring the Roselia out. Come on, can we land this one? We do land this one as we're able to take out the Roselia. Whew, good stuff, good stuff. It was a critical hit. I don't know if it mattered. It probably did matter, though, because Roselia is bulky. As a Politoed is going to come out now. Uh, I think I can go to Floatzel here. So you just go for the Scald, and I'm immune to the burn because I do have Water Veil. Right? <laughs> yeah, I do. As, um, should I Baton Pass here? What's he gonna go into? He could go into Licky Licky, I guess. Yeah, I'm just gonna Baton Pass. He does switch, perfect. So he does go into Licky Licky. And I think I just wanna go straight into Bigger Off on this guy. I can go right for a taunt. Prevent him from protecting. Oh. What does that mean? Wait. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> does one of these abilities prevent taunt? Data. Tempo. Okay, Oblivious does prevent that. That's a really good ability. But I can go into Roselia on this thing. Knockoff is not going to be doing enough. Actually, it is doing enough, but I can synthesis this up. As long as I have speed, I'm pretty sure I do. Maybe I don't. I do. <laughs> as you just go for a wish there. I can get up one more spike on this guy. As he does decide to go pony ta <laughs> rapid dash, I mean. As he is gonna get a wish off to this thing. Which is good for him, but I do still have my Soul Rock at almost full health. So this thing has shown morning sun. It must have flare blitz wild charge. I can eat that up. So it's gotta have flare blitz, and I don't know what its fourth move is, but it's gotta be something. And I just kinda wanna go for morning sun just to be safe. So he does pull a switch into the Miss Drevis. I'm able to get back to full health, and now this thing is out. What do I do with this thing? Looks like a Roselia. Roselia is pretty safe, I think. Goes for a nasty plot. Uh oh. I'm just gonna go for Leaf Storm. Hope that it doesn't KO me. This could be the end of the game right here. <laughs> Yeah, this is not good. <sighs> so I don't have my EV light either. Oh man, this match just took a, quite the turn right now. Shadow Ball is able to pick up the KO. Um. Fortunately, I do have a ton of things to outspeed him. Uh, I think 
I will go. Where do I want to go first? I think jump bluff is my safest play. My max attack. No idea. Let me check. Check the team builder. I am max attack, not adamant though, but that's fine. I could put him to sleep too. I don't know if I want to risk that though. I'm just going to go for damage. Acrobatics does zero. Wow. I should have put him to sleep. Holy crap. <laughs> wow, I have 64 baton passes. What? <laughs> Did anyone else notice that? Uh, I guess hopefully Raichu can put in some work here. It's a shiny Raichu. I don't know, it doesn't look like it. Huh. I guess I just haven't used Raichu ever. <laughs> Alright, he does decide to pull the switch there into Licky Licky. But, uh, all that hazard damage. Yeah, baby! All that hazard damage, you're not taking that twice. So I can just go for another Thunderbolt here. No problem. He's gonna protect, I guess. Get the leftover recovery, but that's not gonna save you. You take down one more of my Thunderbolt. PP, but I get another crit. <laughs> so, uh, it goes down MK. <laughs> Alright, this thing it's not scarfed. We saw it switch up its moves, so I, I know I outspeed. So down goes that. As, uh, that might be game. Because, especially with the stealth rock damage as well, I think this should pick up the KO. Yeah, and Politoed, of course, is not going to be living a Thunderbolt from a Raichu, as he does decide to leave there, forfeiting. So, great first match with this team. I will pause it until we get another one, guys. We'll be right back. Hey, what's up, Dreamers? We're back with another battle, and uh, show me the Raichu switch in. <laughs> For real. Uh, Wormadam. That's the, I believe that's the Steel one. I don't know. Let me check. Worm. Uh, yeah, that's a steel one. So it does not have the ground one. Okay. Uh, they call me Broom. <laughs> Let's see, what's better? Spikes. Does knock target defog? Learn, knock. Defog. Can't learn defog. So there is that to worry about. So let's get the rocks up first since uh, this thing does not like to take rock damage. Crap. Crap is not a good position to be in. <laughs> but I should be able to go into my Roselia, I think. I really want to click Will O Wisp there for a minute, predicting a Swords Dance or something, but definitely not my safest play. As he does. Oh! Jeez. Alright. <laughs> Not great for me. This, this thing does outspeed me as well. So. I'm just gonna go down to another knockoff. <laughs> cool thing though is that uh, Raichu just comes in and basically just kills something. Although, I guess there's a striker could come in. But I'm just gonna go for Thunderbolt anyway. Worm Damn Trash is gonna come out. Ooh, just barely misses out on the KO. Uh, or the two at KO, I should say. But does get the paralyzation. So, uh, I'm just going to pick Thunderbolt again. As, uh, get paralyzed. It goes for a Toxic. Alright, 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 alright. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I'm just going to finish it off with another Thunderbolt. Let's see what he brings in. I think he'd have to bring in the Zip Striker. I feel like yes, bring. He could have a sucker punch or heat more. He could bring Earth Ring, maybe. I guess Earth Ring could probably take one hit. Uh, he just had to go Zip Striker though. As I I'm gonna try to go Vigoroth because the description for this team did say Vigoroth can come in on Life Orb Zip Striker. So, ooh, he's actually physical. He has Quick Attack. Interesting. Ooh, show me the switch into this as well. Uh, I'm just gonna go for body slams. No real point to go bulking up just yet because like there's still some scary stuff on his team, and it's better to just go for damage. Honestly, in my opinion, so the Kingler is gonna come out and take 
not that much from that body slam, but I guess I do need to get some bullet cups going. So I'm going to assume the knockoff is coming. Let's go into um, Jump Bluff. The knockoff does so much, but thankfully we don't have an item. Um, sleep Powder is risky. But he's definitely, he could definitely predict this, this Seed Bomb. What does he have to switch into this sweet Seed Bomb though? for it. Zip Striker comes out. Sap Sipper. Yep. 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 And I believe he has Choice Scarf. <laughs> oh wait, no, he actually does outspeed me. So it looks like he's mixed with Quick Attack. Which is interesting. I should be able to get up my Stealth Rocks here, though. Jesus, Zip Striker is a problem for my team. As the heat more is gonna come out. I'm not sure why. Pretty be predicting the will it was. So I think does have flash fire. Which is kinda crazy. Um I'm just gonna go for Zen Head, but Shadow Claw. Take the Rocky Helmet, Life Orb, and nice Zen Head but damage, baby. I'm gonna morning sun this time. Oh <laughs> okay. <laughs> This guy loves the mixed set. I dig it, I dig it. <laughs> this is not good for me. Not good at all. I think I gotta go right shoe and then go back to uh, Vigoroth on the Sib Striker, I guess. Thunderbolt will KO the heat more. And uh, I'll have to go sub striker here. Oh, he goes Ursa Ring instead. Let's focus blast, focus blast, focus blast. Son of a gun, he's gonna get his quick feet. Ah, we catch the knock towel. <laughs> so the rocks are there to stay. I think we're gonna go down to Toxic though. Yeah. That is unfortunate, that is very unfortunate. I have to go figure off in case he goes up striker because I can't really risk getting hit with a sub striker. Because I believe oh no, this thing isn't choice scarfed, is it? Let me just I'm just gonna go for bulk up. This goes for discharge, no para, no para. Good, no para. So you can get the bulk up off. And I'm gonna go for slack off this time. This goes for discharge again, just fishing for that para, and he does get it. He's are able to slack off though. As now I'm going to go for Body Slam. This is just going to discharge again. Getting a lot of damage there. Going to have to slack off this time. We'll be able to live one more discharge as long as we don't get parried. Okay. Alright. Slack off again. Just so I don't get KO'd. <laughs> He's just waiting for that para. I'm not going to let him have it. I'm going to kill him right now. Boom. Although he can probably KO me with the next any either of his next Pokemon. If, and just in case he doesn't, I'm going to slack off. Alright, we're able to live the knockoff. As we get paired. And the second knockoff is going to KO us, but now I guess it's up to Floatzel. It's up to Floatzel in Power Electric. Oh, why did I lock myself into Hidden Power Electric? Well, at least I took out the Kingler. But that does mean I just lose. <laughs> so... Uh, I did not even think about locking myself in. We get a crit though. The facade is going to take us out. That's GG. Uh, well played, my friend. Uh, we will find another one though. So we will be right back. Well, let's see if this guy says GG or not. Come on, me. Say GG. Alright, I'm not going to wait this long. <laughs> we'll be right back, guys, with another battle. So, guys, we're back with another battle. And guess what? This guy didn't say GG. Uh, but we do have another battle here against AKC Spartan. <laughs> I meant to type an exclamation mark. But this guy's got a cool team. He's got a Baskin and a Go-Go, Marowak, Articuno, Luxray, and Dodrio. Lots of really, really cool Pokemon, in my opinion. Um, 
but stealth rocks are going to be really nice because uh, his only real soul rock counter, well actually his Baskin and Goku -Go are both pretty solid against soul rock. But stealth rock is going to be taking he's going to be taking a lot of damage with his Articuno and his Dojo, which will be really nice for me. So I'm going to try to get those up as quick as I possibly can, as he does actually lead with this thing. Uh, I'm just going to get the stealth rocks up right now, because so I don't really think Articuno can hit me with much. Goes right for the blizzard, jeez. Good god, I'm just gonna go right into uh, Floatzel on this guy. Hopefully he misses a blizzard or two. There we go. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna just hydro pump. I don't think he's gonna switch. I have a feeling he's not. I could be wrong, but I just have a feeling he's not. And Hydro Pump does hit everything as like hard. I guess the Gogo -Go and the Basculin don't get hit that hard, but the rest of his team does. Harder than any of my other moves is the Hydro Pump. Wow. This guy's a champ. Hydro Pump does not do much. I forget how bulky this thing is. Well, I'm gonna go Soul Rock again. He goes extra sensory. <laughs> If he misses a um, blizzard right here, that could be good. So is this just like a soul vest or something? Extra sensory does take us out. Yeah, I should have noticed that was a 2 KO. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Fortunately, uh, Raichu can come in. And uh, do I want to risk the Marowak switching? I don't think I have to. Yeah, I'm just going to take down this thing with a Thunderbolt. And I assume the Marowak will probably come in now, I guess. Yeah, there it is. As I'm going to go jump off. Should be pretty safe. He goes Boomerang, and I am immune to that. Almost want to just go for the Sleep Powder, but I know that Go-Go is sitting right there. So actually, he just has to stay in. I get a crit. As he goes for Rock Slide. Holy moly. All right. Wow, why did I think that would KO? Why did I think that would KO? I should have gone for seed bump. Oh man, that was really poorly played on my part. Really, really, really poorly played. I'll go back into Raichu and Hidden Power Ice should finish off the Marowak. And he fortunate is that he doesn't really have a switch in. <sighs> wow, I can't believe I just let that happen. I, sh I should have known this guy is not the kind of guy to switch up. He's the kind of guy that sends out his Pokemon until it dies. So Marowak goes down to the Hidden Power Ice. And what does he have to switch in now? Gogo -Go can come in, but Gogo -Go probably take an HP ice fairly well. And I guess Luxury can come out too. He does decide to go to Goat Dog. And I can go uh, Roselia pretty safely. As he goes for Leech Seed. And uh, Sludge Bomb is honestly such a good play. <laughs> uh, Hits everything on his team. He actually decides to switch. Wow. And the Dojo comes out and Sludge Bomb KOs the Dojo. That's modest Roselia right there, baby. Uh, not sure what he can do here. So that's a good Luxray. Yeah, I was kind of expecting that. I don't know what he wants to do, though. Does he have like an Ice Fang or something? I'm just going to go for Sludge Bomb. Ooh, and we get the poison. Crunch does a lot. As uh, I'm just gonna synthesis, I think. Synthesis, crunch, yikes. That does so much damage. I'm just gonna synthesis again. <laughs> As he does that, a poison. So I think. I'm going to try to synthesis up no matter what he does. 
but honestly, you might, have, you might just have the game now. Alright, we're able to live the crunch, so I'm going to get another synthesis off. So that's good. We're able to sit on this thing pretty safely. As uh, I'm just going to go for a sludge bomb now. Ooh, we got another poison. This guy has a bunch of dogs on his team. That's the idea I'm getting. So I'm just going to go Vigoroth here to save my Zoro, because Zoro is really my answer to go-go. Uh, and Vigoroth should be able to take any hit from this thing, and it only has uh, two more turns left until it dies to poison, so... should be fine, it should be fine. Even if Vigoroth does go down, I still have Floatzel and uh, Raichu in the back as well. But he's taking his time picking this one. Taking his time picking this move. Uh... I don't know what kind of move he really has though. Like he's gonna, he only has one stealth rock switch in left. Only has two turns left to poison. If he takes stealth rock on a switch in, he'll die to poison that turn as well. So he doesn't really have a play. He just has to kind of go for the crunch and hope I stay in. But I'm not staying in. I'm not sacking my Zoro. I know a sludge bomb will take down this go go right here. I need to play a go 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 team sometime soon. Go go is one of my favorites. Uh, but I'm gonna pause until he picks a move. I'm also gonna start the timer, so we'll be right back, guys. Hey, what's up, guys? He did not come back, so we didn't get the victory on that. But I'm pretty sure we had it wrapped up anyway. Uh, I think I didn't even need to save my my Roselia. I think Vigoroth could have sat on. Go Goat's face anyway. Um, but that is going to be it for this episode of Showdown Live. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, because we're putting Pokemon content out almost every day here on Diggle Dreams. We're putting videos up every day, but not every video is a Pokemon video. So if you want videos every day, Diggle Dreams is the place to be. But until then, guys, keep dreaming. I'll see you next time, and peace out.